Hello everyone, Techfic here, and welcome back to another Let's Explore DC. We're exploring DC episode in the technical beta. Got entrance over here to the big old building. Pretty entrance. Actually in Harvard Square, not Harvard Square, near my apartment in Cambridge, where my girlfriend was going to Harvard, they had these kind of windows overlooking a library that was underground in a courtyard behind our house. Really cool. Apparently they're a common thing in architecture. Got a fancy skull guy that now dances. Awesome. More wanted posters. Can we read any of these? Susan Anspatch. I thought these are real people. I bet they are. Alright, people's relatives or the developers uh, or the developers themselves, because that just came out of splurge Splurred speech. Slurred, not splurred. I don't even know if splurred is a thing. Open AM9. That's not... That's not how we would word things, unless it's different in Washington, D.C. It would be opens at 9 a.m. or closes at 7.30 p.m. That's not proper English. This is better. But that is weird. Open nine. Open six. Six. Just the middle door is open. You guys have different hours on your doors. It's nonsense. Oh, we're getting the pink sunset. Pink as hell up in here. Did I miss anything in here? Just random. Those are like just random trucks and things. Should need to take a right down here. A place we haven't explored. Yep. Hard right. Another entrance and exit to this building. Got some of these paid bicycle stands. Someone left a perfectly good bicycle there. Surprised that I don't honestly think that would still be there. And we can go in this building. And I check left, check right, checking corners. Busted ass keypad. It is dark in here. Oh, hey, that light just kicked in for me. Thank you. Seeing anything in here? There is an elevator. Do I use it? Can I use it? Yep. Oh, it's just like the Division 1. You can go up and down some random buildings, and I'm trusting this random ass elevator. Got a nightclub. Go up. Trash flying through the air in here. Pamphlets raining down. It's really that breezy inside here. That doesn't seem accurate. Nice paintings, though. Well, they're looking for fine art to decorate your uh, fancy little humble abode with. You can uh, come here. They seem to have the modern contemporary. I don't even know if contemporary. Is. It's in a modern art down. Can I open up anything back here? Nope. Can we shoot out the glow cube? What the hell? Oh, they're balloons. That is awesome. Question is, why are there so many locked in a box? So that's... So they just have like 80 balloons mashed in a box made in glass. I'm trying to think, even if, so say this was a party and those are supposed to like come out and explode everywhere. I don't know. No balloons for you guys. I pop all of you. Balloons weighed down. Oh, anyway. 
Really cool. Did not expect that to be balloons in there. Oh, pillows. Nope. Just puts bullet holes. Let's go behind the bar. Check things out. Got on tap. We got balloon white, red, uh, yellow. Almost kind of wants to be a penis, but not really. We got a wannabe train signal. We got barber pole, but yellow. And then we got a uh, green, green square. Like uh, that almost looks like uh, a cologne bottle. Those are your options. I think that's everything. Can we shoot out these? Yes, we can. Interesting. Can I shoot out that? No, I cannot. Some of them you actually have to hit the light bulb itself. No. Bullets just go right through them. No hit markers. Stairs. Stairs are over here. I went up a level. Still this nightclub, more fancy art. It's a big painting. You have to try and drag that down the street. Don't mind me, everyone. Just taking this to my house. You know, post-apocalyptic. It's free loot for all. All those clubs with plants growing in it. This is all hip and shizness. Looks like that's all for the second story. Can we shoot out those lights? No. How about these lights? No. At least those make glass effect sounds. It's looking like it's it. I think there was another staircase here, but I think it goes to where I've already been. Well, I'm sure there's something that takes us here to have some firefight or some side mission. And uh, be an interesting combat environment. It's pretty open. You just kind of come out of an elevator into this shit. Can't take cover there. Well, in any case, we're gonna go back down. As I gently push this button. E. What do I e stand for? Elevator. It's on P1 is parking one. Usually it gets ground level. I don't know what the E stands for in an elevator. I don't think I've ever seen... I'm racking my memory here. E. The thing I've seen. That's the way we came from. So I actually want to keep going this direction. That's cool. We were up there, probably. I punch a hole through that window? No, it's solid mass. left another fancy backpack that I did loot I'm just full of whatever it was what are these super pack super pack Z concrete mix are you prepared for the zombie apocalypse so you just add Z to it and then it turned out to just be the plague Oh, that's a loot box down there for restocking. And I see that fence there I'll be able to bust open. This is really a random place to put this. But, alas, someone decided to put medic supplies all the way down there. Does he have the aim skills? Yes, he does. Get out of here, mice. There's caution tape wrapped around that pole. I have got to be dang near full on inventory space. The fancy trash in here. Property of the District of Columbia government. Uh, I mean, who's gonna steal your trash? But anyways, even though I know it's actually a thing, and like, that's why some towns made their recycle bins hot pink, just so people wouldn't steal them or use them. Ah, oh, people steal just about anything in this sad world they live in. Discover downtown east. I don't really want to be in downtown east, so I want to stick to this right block and explore all that before I move on. Or as much of it as I can in 2 hours and 15 minutes. So that's when the servers bite the dust. You know what's sad is I don't think in any of the betas I participated in that I've completed every single objective, so I'm probably not gonna get the skin 
and the uh, armband for participating in any of the closed betas. But content comes first, everybody. Ooh, a fancy little espresso machine back here. There's like some coffee bricks or bags of coffee. I'm not sure what you call them. I do not drink coffee personally. I am a freak. Up, Santa. You just vanished. Santa's magical. More nutcracker stuff. Ooh, a camera tripod. Huh. Might be like something you almost want to take because it has so many uses. Medical supplies. Not that I need to loot them, but I'm going to. Oh, it's not a lady tied up and killed back there. My lady, I mean, dude, who, what, got put in a corner and just decided to die? I'm sick and dying, and I just want peace, so he sat in a corner. No idea why he's just dying, sitting in a corner. Loot all. I don't think I deleted that much stuff to have this much room. More medic supplies. Medic supplies all over this place. Tarps we can't get through. Yeah, so that's the other side of this where I could come to here, but it was blocked off. And I came down to there and it's blocked off again. So I want to run all the way out here and take a right. I could have sworn when I was higher level this whole area had a bunch of NPCs in it. And I had to fight them here once, and I wandered down it. What do you got over here, Billboard? Take a break. The Face of Freedom. Uncroft Foundation. His life is a legacy. Exhibit open this spring in the newly renovated Uncroft. Nice. Sure, that didn't get many visitors. I had a lot of steam coming out of that vent. More medical supplies, jeez. If you ever need more med kits, you know where to come. Hey birds. Beautiful day in the neighborhood. Do 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 do. Yeah, I did use this in a gunfight and I said I would swip after I did to try out this gun. Stop barricade still up. That is a fence wedged between some woods. Stop dog. Official parking at my mean that's just Someone's been living back here. Or was. Those bed mats would be fairly valuable in this time and age too. At least I think they would be. Heard beeping. Got water pumpage. Stools. Agents requesting backup. Well, isn't that the first one of those I've gotten since I came in here? But no, thank you. Property of District Columbia, yeah, because everyone be stealing everything. Oh, we're going down. Go see what's in the sewers. Not sewers, subway. This is a subway, everybody. Don't mind me and nonsense I speak. Oh, it's blocked off. Lame. It's actually readable. Touch one screen, activate audio, place a credit card, purchase metro card. Cameras for days. One of those cameras just staring at the ceiling. Trying to punch a hole through the window so we can see in here. Oh, on the Division 1, you can interact with the stuff behind the stores. 
Got chairs. Is there anything behind this one? See stuff in there. I just saw like a storefront. Okay, so that was a disappointment. I wonder what they're pumping out down there though. A lot of water pumps running here. And they're flooding out here, making a cesspit. It's very dangerous. Given it feels like being worried about illness and sickness is like kind of a what the ever this state of the game, right? It's I just sworn there was a red line right there. Is that what you're doing here? No, I do not remember doing it here. Nasty. I hear flies buzzing everywhere. Hey, a weapon box. Fat loots? Nope, not fat loots. Look at me, I'm gonna give you a 20 round 9 millimeter. SMG that does no damage. A different type of beer bottle. Those beer bottles actually still have stuff in them and they can float in midair. It's anti grav beer. It's like some shit that would be in Fallout or something. Anti grav beer. It's fancy pickup trucks, but this one's all busted up. Take my sneakers and jump down in there. It's totally sanitary. You know, the lack of cosmetics you find in the open world has me a little concerned. Pretty sure we've already been through here. The second I hit here, I should turn right and there should be a giant gate that I can't go through. Yeah. That was the sound of someone yelling something. More medical supplies. But the lack of cosmetics in the open world, like the first one had them like everywhere, makes me concerned that most of it's going to be monetization. It's, ugh, I really hope they don't microtransaction this game to death. It would really suck. Big 18 wheeler rocking them right here. The world is gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh, we got ourselves one hell of a pile up right there. Someone came in hot. Or they piled all those cars up there after the fact. That might be more the case. Ooh, these things were burned to a crisp. Someone did not appreciate this roadblock. At all. I'm gonna double back here. I saw a doorway I could go through to get into the middle of this building on my right, which we have not done yet. Gotta loot it. Matchbook. Save lives with the matchbook. I don't think matches stay good forever, do they? I have no idea what the shelf life on a match is. Like, I've had old matches that just didn't work. And I guess I don't know if that's because they got wet or improperly stored. But like if you properly store a box of matches, how long would it last? Is that like it's some radio call there? Another medical thing at the bottom of that. Ooh, we can climb up over here. Oh, and I can go in that garage. Okay, let's go in the garage first, then climb up the ladder. Weapon box. Another assault rifle to test out. See if they actually changed anything about it. Where was that one? That was. Oh, it's actually just a rifle. Boom. Unless they changed them. Still by far the most OP weapons in the game, from what I've noticed. For PvE, that is. PvP! LMGs are king, and then these rifles, man. If you've got good accuracy, you could really people up. It's another janked up arm person. It looks like he got into a gun battle with someone. There's spent rounds up here. And empty weapons crates. He's bleeding out everywhere. You lost whatever you did. Bust you open. That's a really fancy lights. I 
think that's everything up here. Yellow tarp means safe to climb down because the division uses tarps to signify things. I got Cran. That's worth carrying around. Electronic device detected. Electronic device General, detected. There's a woman here. Says she's a representative of the theater settlement. Wants to speak with you. What about? She wants to negotiate. Negotiate? Why would we want to negotiate with those people? Stand by, sir. I'll ask her. Uh, sir, she thinks a truce could be mutually beneficial. Shoot her, Lieutenant. Sir? Shoot her and dump her body where those cowards will find it. And if anybody else comes to negotiate, shoot them too. Understood? That's fucked up. Uh, yes, sir. You're just gonna follow those orders? Man, your loyalty must run really fucking deep. Again, I guess if you don't follow orders and they shoot you, do you have to do it? That's where you start to run into this gray area. Does that make it right? And I think the answer is always a no on that front, but like... Who is it? That's a slippery slope to talk about. Try that pistol. You know, all these non-set backpacks could just get deleted. Those are all sets. Chess, might as well. Delete, delete. Just need to make some room, and right now I'm prioritizing sets over non-sets. Seems like the next logical step, right? What are we selling up in here? Is this just a larger coffee menu? Yep, it is. The same price? Yeah, same price as the little stands at the fair, too. Are these apples one thing? Yep. You guys know if you shoot the apples, they immediately become peeled. That is a lesson for life. If anyone ever asks you to peel something, just shoot it. Please don't actually ever do that. Kitchen upstairs with a dead guy. Should, uh, not have gotten whatever happened to you. Unless you were the one saying you're gonna negotiate, but I think it's a lady. Not a dude. Got some more of that modern art up here. Bathrooms are boarded off. Really doesn't seem to be any point to the upstairs other than to find that dead guy. Can't climb through the window. That other staircase should have just led down to right here. I'm just fact checking myself. Yep, that is where it led to. Okay. So other than that recording, there wasn't really anything too back here. Which way did I come to get in here? This of that into that. Is there another way out back here? That's the truck. Doesn't look like it. Water pumpage. Back out the way we came. Hook a right. Leave that. Oh, this car got flipped on its side and someone didn't light that flower pot. Almost looks like someone tried to properly clean up that fuel leakage, but failed. Does it light? No, it does not. Sticky grenade thing actually has a um, gas grenade that you can light and cause an explosion. So I was curious if they did that for that also. I'm just dumping all the luggage down there. Hey, a stuffed animal. Rip the system. We say no and demand more. Kick the crap out of all this BS. Right. Is that a... No, it's a bag. Okay, it's a lowering bag. I was like, is that a fucking car up on that roof? Like a taillight? <laughs> World is broken. Yeah, it is. Boom. Boom, 
like I want to say boom goes the government, but boom co the government. I don't know. Uh, break the Washington break broke life. Long boat. Not the time for temper. Roller joy. We will be tagging. We will always be tagging. Never be an end to the tagging. That sound makes me think it should be fat loose, but just a single electronics. Killing time. Um, I guess we'll explore this way. Loots. You know what happens when I stand like this, everyone. I think it's time to end this episode, and I do appreciate the support, and thank you all for watching, and I can't wait for this game to actually come out, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Dig out.